This is CNEagles.com. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, alongside Carson Newman head soccer coach Richard Moody. Richard, talking about scheduling and the 2013 campaign for your Carson Newman men's soccer club. What do you hope this schedule does for your team, uh, setting you up for 2013? Yeah, we've made a few changes from last year. Um, obviously, we've added two more teams to our conference. It's, we'll see the arrival of Coker and uh, in Queens, we're very excited to have them in the conference and it makes things a lot more competitive, um, especially just trying to get into the, the SAC tournament and obviously trying to be uh, competing for the league, you know. I mean, with the boys' schedule, we've, we've made a few adjustments, you know. We, we had two preseason games last year and maybe felt like we went into the season maybe just a little bit underprepared and so we've made a small adjustment and we'll be hosting three scrimmage games. Uh, one here and two on the road to prepare us and better prepare us to start off the season on the right foot and get uh, players in place. And so, uh, you know, schedule-wise, we've, we've added a few new teams in and around the schedule, and uh, we've seen a lot of new, uh, a lot of new teams on our schedule. But a lot of it is the same um, uh, as we prepare to go into the season. Uh, primarily just because of the two new arrivals of, of teams in the conference. And so for us, it doesn't leave a lot of opportunities to play teams outside the conference. But uh, uh, for us, you know, with our schedule, you know, we'd like to think that we end up second in the league with the boys last year. And, you know, we'd like to think we can do better this year. And uh, that just leaves one spot, you know. And so, uh, you know, we'd like to think that this year we're going to compete for the championship. And we're, we're obviously looking to get back into the uh, the. the the conference tournament and hopefully even advance further and I think that's where this team belongs and where it should be. You have to win quickly that, that that's evident with this schedule you play one non-conference game against Belmont Abbey to start the season and then bam you're in against a Wingate team that uh, made the NCAA tournament last year on s September 14th. Uh, you talk about the preseason games H how do you gear up to win quickly in conference games let's face it mean a little bit more than non-conference uh, you know you like to think you've done your preparation with recruiting and uh but it still takes time to figure out where personnel go and, and luckily for us we we didn't have that many uh graduate last year that, that were regular first team uh players and so for us you know we like to think that the core is already established and we're just going to add uh the, the the new recruits in and around in the mix you know and, and for us it's, it's it's very important to get things quick you know our, our season uh, our season is now delayed to the first weekend in september versus the last in august so that week makes a whole lot of difference and it's like you say you know we we play out of conference and all of a sudden we're right into the conference games and there's no room for error uh, in the soccer season you know and unfortunately we don't get to see many teams twice or play them you get one shot at them in conference and that's the you know that'll be the end result and so you know, you'd like to think it, it, you've got to depend a little bit on luck as well, and you just hope that everyone's healthy going into games, and uh, uh, you know, we, we just can't make any mistakes. And again, that's why we've chose to go with three scrimmage games prior to the season, is so we can try and iron out the kinks and, and make sure going into that first conference game, we have the best starting eleven that we can that are healthy and fit to play. So, Carson Newman Soccer is known for its promotions. Uh, you brought skydivers in, you've flown helicopters in to McCowan Field. If you had to pick a home game for Eagle fans to attend, obviously you want them at all, but if they can just make one trip into Mossy Creek, which Carson Newman home soccer game do you want them to attend? Uh, I do, but you know, obviously we like to have them at all, like you say, and, and we appreciate the fan base that we have, and, and I think that's what makes it so difficult for teams to come here to McCowan Field and win, is the fact that you know, we have a good support. We, you know, the college, the, or rather our university is right behind us and the community is behind us, and you know, we appreciate that. Uh, and usually we like to do something at every game, um, but uh, you know, to be honest with you, you know, we're going to put a lot of emphasis on these these home conference games because it's like you're saying, and you know, you don't have many opportunities. And, and for us, we have to get it right first time. And so we want to make it as a competitive place as possible for teams to come in and play us. And I genuinely think teams don't like coming here to play us just because of the, you know, when we played Tusculum here, we had over a thousand people just crammed around the field, and it made it a very difficult place to play. And traditionally, that's been a, a huge asset to us as soccer. And so for us, you know, especially all the home conference games people are going to get to come out and see good matchups and good level of competition and more importantly get behind the, the local team and, and that's really what we want. So. Moody, pleasure as always. Thanks. Carson Newman head soccer coach Richard Moody. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, and this is CNEagles.com.